oh oh hi there <laughs> you're what's going on y'all this is divine hero angel here back at it again with another yet another zombie survivors video um and in this one we're going to tackle one of the achievements uh which is actually going to be i believe no nope, not that one uh this one right here survive the hardcore version of isolated city complete isolated city in hardcore game mode um i've been putting this one off for a little bit because i kind of wanted to make a video about it and like i've been you know doing other things in the meantime so we are actually going to do this right now what kind of team do i want to go with honestly i'm going with the tank as the lead hardcore isolated city now we're gonna go with the crit build i believe so um the crit build that i i personally personally like myself so okay i thought i was i was over here thinking i'm, I'm playing um the other survivors game where i had to point the mouse and stuff so here when we start off we start off still at horde level one and I believe we have to survive. Um, ten minutes. So let's just do that. It shouldn't be too too difficult. I think the zombies might start ramping up as fast as they do in. Um. Oh. Oh, I was trying to get the uh, the achievement low key. Damn, that might be that might be uh might be a wrap. Um, so I believe we only survive. Um, we only have to survive for ten minutes in this game mode, and also we will try to simultaneously complete the other achievement, the one that's called the Raining Men. I I, I think it's called it's where you have to get uh ten. 10 zombies in midair at the same time. I kind of screwed that up because I got, I already got an AOE ability, so that might screw us over. But if we get all the zombies grouped up, we might be able to get. Oh, we might be able to get all 10, depending. Because uh, from what I've seen, the horde densities in Hardcore are much greater than they are in um, any other game mode. In the other two game modes. Any other, brother. Um, okay. And I keep saying um a lot. Alright, so let's grab these upgrades. Uh, let us get bombing strike. It'll it'll help us get more um, kills. One, two, three, four. Okay, this four. Sure. Let's get weapon fire rate and movement speed. Can always use more movement speed. SOS signal protected. All right, so we are looking for. <sighs> Screw it, let's get the rocket launcher. Let's get the saw blade. Let's see if hopefully we can get that achievement simultaneously while just completing the hardcore achievement and I literally just walk right past the SOS oh, okay. and while doing so we just finished maxing auto rocket all right cool 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 all right so we need either the huntress or ghost we get ghost which is good Immediately start leveling up the katana. Let's get protocol. Kat 
katana. I think we might get it. Like, I don't know if we're going to get, like, a, a notification popping up. Like, now or towards the end. Focus on the splash already. But we should be getting it soon, hopefully. Cross my fingers. Maybe I need to disable auto attacks. Maybe I need to disable auto attacks. It's not a big deal if we don't get it. Let's get the congratulations letter. It's not a big deal if we don't get it, but... Oh my god, this dude's running at me. But it would be pretty cool if we did get it. Um, where is the SOS? Did I walk past it? Yeah, I did walk past it. Huntress? Maybe? Wow, we got literally everybody. Alright, so with the Huntress 2, we could uh, possibly get... We could possibly get the... Uh, Explosive arrows and explosive arrows also help with um, like blowing up enemies and sending them into the sky. And we only need 10 enemies in the sky at the same time. I don't need wind cutter. Let's get bow again. Thousand cuts would be cool. Let's get thousand cuts. Although I, I think maybe getting a thousand cuts is a bad idea because they're not gonna be flying into the sky. Okay, well if we get if we get it's raining men, um if, if we get the raining men it's raining men achievement um while also completing the hardcore, then we get it. If not then it's whatever. I can just I can just try attempting this some other time. Critical damage book fire rate. Get the saw blade drawn. Eagle eye, get some more crit, crit damage. at the halfway point what's our level four levels for level three it's not too too bad yeah in um in endless it's um the levels ramp up much quicker the levels ramp up much quicker but there are less zombies so Zombie decoy. I mean, we might have an opportunity to get it. We might not. Especially, possibly le leaning more towards the might not because uh, <sighs> we did uh, we did get thousand cuts and that that might actually just screw us over. We're not doing a lot of DPS, which is uh, understandable. Because we have the rocket launcher instead of the minigun, so we're doing less uh, less damage per second. But the rocket launcher does a lot, like a stupid amount of, 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 uh, of damage. But if we get a crit on it, it it'll, it'll put in work. We can banish this. We already banished, so we can't banish this. Let's re-roll. 
Let's get life stage. Check. Let's get a uh, vampire survivor. Constantly on the lookout for um, any upgrades that spawn into the field, which, which one just did. Let's get the protocol. Critical. Critical protocol. Eagle eye. Explosive arrows. Hmm. Eli again. Alright, so let me go into the settings real quick. Alright, never mind. I thought that was a setting to uh, disable auto attack so I can try to like group up all the zombies and stuff, but unfortunately not. So. We're kind of stuck with what we got, so we're most likely not going to get that achievement because I'm pretty sure if we would have gotten it, it would have uh, it would have popped up. So that's my bad. I kind of I kind of went too quick with the uh, with the upgrades. Right, at least we got explosive arrows at max, so that can help us. Zombie decoy. Zombie decoy is um is kind of underrated because a huge a huge issue with um oh there's an upgrade over here. Oh my god, our, our HP is actually super low. We need to chill the hell out. An issue with uh with limit uh endless endless runs. The fact that Oh my goodness, we take so much damage from me. Hold up, hold up. Actually, I'm gonna take this. I ain't trying to die. Whoa, 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 whoa. Huge issue with uh, running endless is the fact that... Um... A bunch of uh, towards towards the like the 30 minute mark, oh actually towards the 25 minute mark, a bunch of uh, hatchet uh, zombie boss enemies start spawning or elites or whatever it's called, um, and those they, they really run up to you and they do a bunch of damage to you. But if you have a uh, a zombie decoy out like that little like monkey bomb thing, it will grab its attention. If it's a, if it's if uh, that you know bomb is like in the in its line of sight so it'll it would be pretty helpful there's an SOS down here um the only bad thing about it is that i guess the the uh the attention the attention like grabbing range of it is pretty low so you'd have to like lead uh the hatchet zombies to um, to the bomb. So hopefully they can buff that eventually. But ooh, regeneration, yes, yes sir. Okay, damn. Let's get minefield. Look at that, look at that, it's grabbing his attention. Oh, it blew up. Oh! There goes two thirds of our health in an instant. Get the last one of these. Another 
frenzy. Cool, 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 cool. Shoot. Okay, we just got another armor, so we should be safe for a couple of seconds. Shit. I, at the very least, want to finish this challenge. We're just, we're literally just 10 seconds away. I can just taste it. Damn, it could have given me health, but, you know, whatever. Oh, let's share this graph share again. Oh, the exploding zombies. Health. I think we did it. I, I think, I think we just did it. We did. Hey, okay, we survived. Yeah, I'm a pro gamer. Cool, 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 cool. Yep, we only just did the one. Was hoping I could have done, you know, the, you know, both the things, but I guess. Um. All right, that's fine. That's fine. I can um, I can try again next time. I will probably do a, a tank again and then um, try to get the try to get that multi kill early without without buying any skills. I'll just focus solely on the shotgun. Try to get the rocket launcher ASAP and then and then go from there. But, but anyway, uh, that's it. That's it for the vid. Thank you so much for uh, for watching. I hope this uh, hope this helped. If there were, if there was, if there would be anything I would change about this setup, it would be that I would change the hunters for possibly the medic. Uh, that way, you would have uh, an, an e a much easier time surviving. With you know, um, you would have the tanks armor leader skill plus the dodge leader skill from having ghosts on your team plus having the hundred percent. Um, heal is it is that it yeah you have 100% healing or whatever um, when you have medic on your team so you you would you'd be pretty hard to kill so that would make this run much easier if you're trying to go for it yourself um, I might I might just do that next time just to I guess turn it into a guy type thing but yep yeah, that's it uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to sting of that like button and subscribe for more content Thank you for watching, guys. Peace.